Okay. Here's some shells you probably used to. 223, 7.62, 4570, hollow points, uh, 30, 40 Craig, 8 millimeter Mauser, 30 out 6, and then something you might not be a little used to. That there is a 5 inch or 127 millimeter shell from World War II. Empty. And it has dummy stamped on it on the on the fuse. Um, they demilitarized this one. It was probably used for uh, training purposes on a ship is all I can figure out. It used to be green. I had to paint it black because the old paint was just flying off of it. Um, it don't have a crimp band on the bottom and what I was reading is that these bands tell a lot about it um, I'm having a hard time figuring out what exactly gun it went to if it went naval or um, um, might have been a army or navy or some kind of training round for National Guard anyways it's a pretty rare round and you never see one like this I've been looking for years for one um, complete with the shell and fuse and they're just impossible to find this one has holes in it, it's been stamped dummy and um, in various spots um, it's inert it's a neat piece of history I think it's from 43 ish I think is kinda of what I've kinda of figured out 40 to 45 maybe anyways it's about 60 pounds maybe maybe pushing 65 okay I don't think this had a shell casing I'm not sure usually they had a crimping band down here if they had a shell casing a groove that was hollowed out around the um, the rings here the brass rings this one don't seem to have it so I kinda think this was like a howitzer style or a navy cannon that um, they pack powder behind it but I'm not sure I'm not a shell expert and uh, tracking this guy down has been uh, really tough